Hey guys, it's Army Brat Bricks, and we're back here with another Lego video. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on a Lego upright piano. I designed this piano for a Lego mock house that I'm building, and brown fit the color scheme of my house, but if you have another color that you would like to create your piano, then you can substitute pieces. Um, this piano has 45 pieces, and I think that it's a pretty good design, so let's get building. Okay, so step one is to build the lower panel of the piano, and so we're going to start with a one by six brown plate, and we're going to add two one by two tan vent pieces to the middle right there, and then we're going to take two one by two brown plates and we're gonna add them onto each side. And the tan vents are going to serve as pedals for our piano. So now we're going to add a one by six brown plate on top to cover the back half up. And then we'll take a two by six brown plate and add that on top. Okay, and then last, we will take two one by two brown bricks. We're gonna add them onto each side of the two by six plate. Okay, that's step one. All right, step two is the legs of the piano. So we're gonna start with two one by one brown rounded bricks. And on top of each, we're going to add a one by one brown modified brick with stud coming out the side. And then on top of each of those, we're going to add a one by one brown plate. And then let's just lay these down. And we're going to add four one by three brown plates. But first we'll make two stacks. So just stack those like that. And then we'll put one stack on top of each with it being in the front like that. And then we'll add it to this one as well. Okay. And then finally on the top of each in the front, we'll add a two by one brown tile. All right, that's Step two, so let's add it on to the rest. Okay, so these are just going to go right on the two one by two studs, right there and right there. All right, so that's the end of step two. Okay, so step three is the keyboard. Um, so we're gonna take a two by four black plate and we're gonna add four one by two vent pieces and we're just going to place them across the top and I know at the beginning I said that you could substitute colors but at this part you kind of are going to want the black and white pieces because when you place them together it looks like keys and this is not my idea but it's one of the best ways to create keys so I borrowed it. All right, next we're gonna take a brown one by four plate and we're gonna add two tan modified tile pieces and we're just gonna put them across our plate. And then finally, we're going to take a two by four brown plate and we're gonna add a two by four brown tile. I was lucky enough to have a two by four brown tile. If you do not, two two by twos would work. Um, so that is okay as well. All right, so now we're gonna take our key piece and we're going to place it one stud off of the middle, right like that. And then we're going to take this back piece and we're gonna place it back behind our keys like this. Okay, and then we're going to take this piece and you're going to slide it in between and you're just gonna let it sit 
right there, like that. All right, that's step three. So let's go on to step four. Okay, step four includes a cover for the keys that works well with the keyboard cover um, because it covers the front. So we're just going to add this one by six tile to the two studs in the front. And you can see it covers the keys completely up. And then the second part of step four is the upper panel. So we're going to take two one by two tan bar elements and these are going to serve as the piano music holder um, and then we'll take one one by six brown brick and we're just going to stick that on top like that and then we'll take another one by six brown brick and we'll stick it on top of that and then finally we'll take a one by six tile and we'll smooth it off with that and then we're going to place this on the back two studs, right there, like this. Okay, that is step four. So let's move on to step five. Okay, so step five is the final step, and in this step, we're going to build the piano bench. So first we're gonna take a two by four tan tile, and for this part of our piano, we do need a two by four tile, uh, because if you added a plate underneath to connect smaller tiles, then the bench would be too high. So we're going to flip this over and we'll take two one by two brown plates and we're going to add them to each side like that. And then we'll add four one by one rounded plates and we're gonna add these on top of the one by two plates. Okay, so when you flip it over, there is your piano bench. And something cool about this piano bench is you can slide it under the piano and you can actually pick up the piano with the bench because of the pedals underneath that we built in step one and they hold them there and then you can easily slide the piano bench back out. Okay, now your piano is finished. All right, so now that we finished building our piano, let's take a look at some of the play features. Okay, so here's a music piece, and you can see that you can put that right on there, on the music stand, and it fits well. Um, that music piece we got on BrickLink, and it is printed, but if you don't have a printed music piece, you could use a two by two tile with a sticker. Um, and as you can see, it is minifig scale. There's the minifig right there. And we can take her and put her on the bench and she can look at the music. And then the last feature that we haven't showed you yet is that you can push, push that and the keys will open up and the minifig has access to play the piano. Um, the opening and closing mechanism isn't attached to the piano, but because of friction, it stays in place. So when you lift it, it doesn't come out. There goes our music. Um, so that's cool. And then um, you can see she can play the piano. Um, I have other creations that I have made in my mock house. Um, so there will be more tutorials to come. Uh, if you have any comments, uh, what you think of the piano, if there's a part that you like specifically, or if there are any improvements you think that could be made, please tell us in the comments. And uh, if you would like a closer look at the pieces we used, you can, con you can 
find us on Instagram and we'll put a link to our Instagram account in the description and uh, soon we'll have a city overview coming so stay tuned for that uh, please give us a like and subscribe if you want more Lego videos thanks guys Thank you.